Most homeowners are unfamiliar with the intricacies of their septic system. It is important to know the size of your tank and leaching bed and where it is all located on the property. Out of sight should not mean out of mind. As with other items in your home, maintaining your septic system ensures that your home or cottage are safe for your family and guests. Failed septic systems can be hazardous to the environment and your pocketbook. It can degrade water supplies and reduce your property value. Here are some helpful tips to ensure the longevity of your system. Do familiarize yourself with the location of your septic system, and if it has them, all its components such as pumps, control panels, and high water alarms. Don't dig without knowing the location. Get the required utility locates done and keep a system diagram for reference. When purchasing a home or cottage, accurate records of the system may not be available, but you can hire a professional to help locate your tank and leaching bed. Do keep accurate records of maintenance, pump outs, and service calls for future reference. If you are the owner of a new home or cottage, you can get a head start on responsible record keeping. Do repair leaky plumbing fixtures and replace old toilets with low flush models to help reduce the amount of wastewater that must be treated. All your water from your home, not just from the loo, heads into your system. Conserving your water usage goes a long way for preventing breakouts. Stagger your wash loads, don't run the taps unnecessarily, and properly maintain your plumbing. Do install an effluent filter in your septic tank to protect your leaching bed and to ensure you are in compliance with the Ontario Building Code. Effluent filters help trap solids to prevent them from clogging your leaching bed. If you've had some guests over and accidentally overused your system, solids can quickly pass through the tank into the bed, but not so much when you have that handy effluent filter. Do keep the access lids easily accessible and securely fastened. Make sure they include a safety screen to prevent accidents with small animals or children. Do ensure that the leaching bed has good erosion control post-installation. Most systems have grass over top, but you can use some landscaping materials such as mulch as long as they allow for proper evaporation. Don't build over the tank or leaching bed with a hard surface such as asphalt or stones. Don't plant any trees or shrubs on or near the bed. Their roots can clog pipes and cause serious damage over time. Do divert surface water away from your leaching bed to allow sufficient drainage in the bed. Don't drain downspouts, sump pumps, etc. down or near the tanks or leaching bed, and don't excessively water the lawn over the leaching bed. If there's too much surface water, the bed won't function properly and may contaminate your groundwater. Do pump out your septic tank. Depending on your usage, this may be every three to five years. Ask your pumper to record the depth of sludge so you can monitor your usage for future pump outs. Do rinse and clean your effluent filter twice a year. Do ensure your home insurance policy includes a sewage backup rider. Most policies do not automatically include this, so make sure you read the fine print and request it if necessary. Other helpful tips for what not to do with your sewage system include don't allow vehicles to drive over or park on the leaching bed. Don't build skating rinks or above ground pools on it. Don't use a garbage disposal or garburetor. Don't leave interior faucets on to protect water lines during cold spells. Instead, properly insulate or heat your faucets and plumbing. Don't discharge water softener backwash to the septic system unless your system has been designed for it. Don't enter a tank. Gases and lack of oxygen can be fatal. Don't ignore odors or sogginess around your system. Some items you flush down a toilet or pour down a drain can significantly reduce the ability of beneficial bacteria in a septic system to break down and treat domestic sewage. Harmful chemicals and substances will kill helpful bacteria and seriously impact the system's functionality. To maintain healthy levels of microorganisms in your system, don't use, flush, or drain. Antibacterial soaps, automatic toilet bowl cleaners, flushable wipes or other sanitary products, liquid fabric softeners, harsh chemicals, food scraps and coffee grounds, oils, greases and fats, drain decloggers, cigarette butts, sanitary products, or pharmaceuticals. Remember to only use natural and biodegradable cleaning products without phosphorus. On-site sewage systems should last between 20 to 30 years or longer if properly maintained and used as per their design. Do consider how changing the use of your home, such as adding a second living space, 
will impact the septic system. To make sure yours is functioning properly, use our Find a Professional directory to call your local UA member wastewater professional. For more information on how to properly manage your system, visit our website at www.oowa.org. Under the Homeowner Resources tab, you will find our Homeowner's Guide to a Healthy Septic System. Your sewage system is a critical piece of your home's infrastructure and can be costly to repair or replace. Treat them with the respect they deserve. Be on-site proud.